Hello America, this is Keith, your friendly neighborhood technician, coming back at you with some more really good information. Today, we're going to talk about summertime, summer cabins, things we do for fun that we ignore all year long. Well, one thing people that are moving to Colorado, people who live here, may or may not realize that Colorado and Denver is actually an arid, semi-desert climate. Yes, we've got lots of trees, but they've all been imported. This is actually called, considered a high desert plain. What that means is we don't have a lot of moisture and we don't have a lot of humidity. Well, that's not a bad thing unless you like humidity, which I don't. My hair goes poof when I get humidity. We don't like that. I don't like that kind of look. But what I'm talking about is use and not use of your appliances, okay? What I mean by that is, okay, we've got washers, we've got dryers, we've got all those dishwashers, all the stuff that has rubber washers and gaskets in it, okay? Now, me, I do my dishes by hand and I pretty much ruined my own dishwasher because I never used it. What I mean by that is, the pump will still turn on, the motor will turn on, but I'm going to probably leak and I'll show you why. This is about the average size of a pump gasket or a motor gasket of a dishwasher, okay? That's rubber, that's not real bad. Now, this is actually a brand new unit. It hasn't been in my house for six months, not getting any use, not getting any moisture, okay? This is a average thickness and size of a clothes washer, okay? If I don't use my dishwasher for, let's say, two or three months at a time, the lack of humidity, the lack of moisture, will actually cause this to become brittle and lose its ability to retain water. Whereas in this one, it's a much, in my washer, if I don't use it, this one is a much thicker gasket, which is actually going to take a lot, lot longer. So if I didn't use my washer for, let's say, a couple of months, this is still going to be a good usable seal. My dishwasher, on the other hand, this is actually going to start to get brittle. So if you haven't used your dishwasher in, let's say, two months, I'm not saying don't use it, but don't use it and walk away. You turn it on, let it run, check for leaks. Because I guarantee you, if this has gone brittle or gone saw or hard, it's going to leak, you're going to have big problems. So make sure that if you haven't used, like I said, you're going to go up to your cabin, you've got a cabin in the mountains, it's time to spend some time up there, you haven't used your dishwasher since you left, check it first. Because the first biggest mistake you can make is, oh, i got to wash all my dishes to get them clean from all the dirt. Throw them in there, walk outside, go fish, and come back in an hour later after you got your three trout, uh, lake trout, and you look at, oh, I'm flooded. That's because this seal has gone bad. There's a couple, two or three of these on your dishwasher. So you want to make sure that they're all in good shape. Because it guaranteed, if you leave it alone, it's warm enough that all the water that's, because there's always supposed to be water inside the sump of a dishwasher, okay? If there's not, everything in there start to dry. And yes, this is a rubber gasket, and yes, it is springy, yes, it does do that, but it will also, in a left out, in an unused position, it's going to get brittle and it's gonna get dry, which means you lost your water. So, don't forget to subscribe to this YouTube channel and we'll have more good information for you next time. And remember, watch your seals before you walk away from them because if they leak, you're gonna have a very bad summer. Have a good day.